Today we are making an easy vegan prosciutto with one simple ingredient and a flavorful marinade. Prosciutto is traditionally a sweet, delicate ham that is thinly sliced, cured, and air dried. My plant-based version has all the same flavors and textures and is perfect for a charcuterie board or any appetizer. This recipe is a part of my holiday party and potluck series here on YouTube where I make crowd-pleasing appetizers that are plant-based. Stick around till the end of the video for that playlist and let's get started. In a shallow dish, combine a half cup of water, one teaspoon of liquid smoke, two teaspoons of vegan Worcestershire sauce, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of black pepper, and one teaspoon of salt. Next, add in one tablespoon of vegan miso paste, and a fourth teaspoon of beetroot powder. Be careful with this stuff, it will stain your hands and anything it touches, so make sure to wipe up any spills right away. Whisk until the miso and beetroot powder have been dissolved. To create the thin slices of prosciutto, I'm stacking together three sheets of rice paper and then immersing them in the marinade. Allow these to soak until most of the marinade has been absorbed for about two to three minutes. The sheets are going to stick together, giving us that thick consistency. Cut each piece into four large or eight small strips. Then carefully transfer the mock prosciutto to a cooling rack or plate to dry. Rub the strips generously with olive oil. The oil is essential in keeping the texture. Without the oil, it will become dry and rubbery. This prosciutto is excellent fried or on its own. I am serving mine two ways. The first way is with my homemade mozzarella, some fresh fruit, and basil. This is also great on a piece of toasty bread. All three written recipes are linked in the comment and description box below and at veganalohakitchen.com. Store in the fridge for up to two weeks, making sure the strips don't touch, otherwise they will become a gloopy mess. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my new recipes. As always, thanks for watching. Mahalo, and I'll see you in the kitchen.